In today's video, I'm going to show you how to edit column type in your tables here in Google Sheets. So if you're working with a pre-built table and you want to edit your column type, here's how you can do it. Here in my example, we have a table of example data. We have the region column, salesperson, product, cost, sales, and commission. You'll notice that my first two columns are already in a drop-down type column. Now, what if I want to turn my third column into the same type of column? What I can do is to go to the top where that column name is, then go to the drop-down right next to it on the right. There we go. Once you click on that, you will see these options right here. At the very top, you will see edit column type. And here are the options for our column type. So we can choose to have it in number, text, date, drop down, checkbox, smart chips, or none. Right now it's at none, but if we want to turn it into a drop down, we can just click on this right here. And there you have it. Now we have our data validation rules on the right because now our criteria for this column is a drop down. Here are all the unique values for that column. We have the camera bag, the tripod, memory card, and camera lens. And to personalize it even further, we can change the colors for each of those drop downs, like what we have in our first two columns. So if we change the color for our camera bag into this color, there you have it. Select the colors that you want for each of those items. Once you click on done, it will be applied to your column. And there you have it. Next one, we have our cost, sales, and commission. So as you'll notice, these are numeric values that are in currency, but you'll notice that at the top of that column, we have this icon that represents currency. So at the moment, it's only our cost column or D column that is in a currency type of column. If we want to change our next two columns in the same way, again, all you have to do is to click at the top of that column, go to the right side where you will see your drop down, click on it and select edit column type. Here we have our number at the top and we have number, percent and currency for our choices. Let's click on currency. And there we have it. We will have the same icon as our cost column right here. Let's do the same thing for our commission. Again, click on that drop down right next to our column name. Go to edit column type, select number and click on currency. And there you have it. So now we have different icons for each of our columns right here, which easily identifies what type of column we have for our table. Now, if you want to change our region to, let's say, just the name, we can click again on that drop down, select edit column type, go to text. And there you have it. We will have that T icon on the left side of that column. And if I were to add another column right here and change it into something else, I can just go to that drop down, select edit column type. And if I want to create a checkbox for this column, I can just click on that. And there you have it. So that's how easy it is. You can edit your column type within your tables here in Google Sheets. Thank you for watching this quick tutorial. Make sure to subscribe for more helpful videos and I will see you in the next one.